Now, edwa we mukamba OG eh you must know um siombo ya mwele, right? Uh and then we see uh Irene Wavinya mwetu esele um capital T uh mwanzo angindilika ni imba ito. Um if you know those people then definitely know siombo ya mwele. Nundu she was one of the pioneers ma radio broadcasting sio kamba okay and um she did a very good job to a point where uh, you just could not ignore her and whether you liked it or not you just you know had to listen to her shows right and she would bless you uh, i think she used to do shows on sundays kama sijakosea yeah na kubika bandu geza kwa ya nuko na maundu tano makoyote kumukumba hivi sasa it's a bit worrying and it becomes a matter of interest is she even okay yeah nundu is one thing eh kuisila mawesulo magu uh, in private and it's another thing eh to go through tribulations kana trials in public is a tough one you guy my guy Alright, welcome to this YouTube channel. Make sure that you subscribe and subscribe. You can always see the network and you can go up and watch. And that was the lead of I am. Make sure that you also get to do the same. Imagine this free. All you need to do is just hit that subscription icon. Okay, now you are ready, and that will be it. Right? Can I give you some time to do that? Great. Right. So done. Thanks. Now let's move on eh just chime in let's talk about the story kana maondwa uh, maybe to lately my nene wa yulua siombo amwele now we know her as siombo osiani um she is the wife to the former cas eh? uh david osiani all right and if i'm not wrong i think they've been married for 7 going to eight years now um they have a child together and the marriage was beautiful according to what they get to share online there are people that have been close-knit um the people that are a couple that really praise they are a couple that you know i think that we have seen them most of the times when we get to see them openly then we get to see them monica and uh, uh they will be somewhere praying they will be somewhere you know what 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 prayer partners okay that is the word that's a word we can probably go by okay and um nobody actually thought that um such things would come to face them at one point nundu um if we go by what the society um societal standards with a uh, people that pray kanando people who are um spiritual kana I don't like using the word religious cuz I hate it. I hate religion, okay? I like people who are free who've been saved. Yani I think there's a video I did about that explaining the difference between religion and salvation. I like people who've been freed. See what ambao wanafuata uh, religion. Ndio religion ni man's attempt to reach God. But salvation can Christianity by what it is. Um it's it's god's attempt to reach man okay which is the way to go by but now we have a lot of religion happening in the world sometimes i i, I i'm almost thinking that christianity is also um a religion because it's been so corrupted lately that <sighs> we have to follow people's orders to get to god now there is god's protocol that is supposed to be i i digress Let's come back to um Siombo Amwele's story that um has been taking rounds around social media platforms, a lot of exchanges. Na Siombo Amwele has been quiet about it. I think she's one of those women who would just pray about the issue, okay? And what is the matter? I need and magoro gole. What is the matter? If you've not come across this exchanges, I'm going to be putting them here. And the exchanges between the husband to Siombo Amwele, ula weta wa David Osiani na madam mwita wa Maverick huko na Maverick sijui ni mwita feminist sijui ni mwita namna gani because me myself ndine nenea nye yuta kwa nye na namumanie bila weki we interview ni what is the name of this guy is a comedian 
Ofweneke, Ofweneke. And she was talking about, she had a very different perspective on um, the sexuality of men, terming them as polygamous by nature. And I think that's when the message got to spread far and wide because she was, um, yani, opinion yake was a bit different from what the society agrees with and you know she's also very outspoken uh she's at when she was coming out maverick was that kind of a person while they were on there too they speak what is in their minds and they don't hold back nothing okay and uh, she came out lately to call out ODM politicians and saying that they're abusive, especially sexually. Uh, she was herself abused. Now, the first person to pick on individually, Anae Mume Wasiombwa Mwele, David Osiani, Ndasiakana, they had, um, if I may call it, quote, quote, an affair, because these are allegations, there's no proof yet, yeah. Um, they had an affair during the COVID uh, times, that is 2019, we're talking of two years back. Um, she talks about how he went to Herbert Sita, packed a 30 million car outside, she calls it a COVID stolen money. We all remember the investigation done by NTV of COVID billionaires, um, uh, and I think that is where she was actually coming from. Um Eh, hey, as yeah, they had a thing, she talks about even warning him. Na mume wasio mbwa mwele David Osiani asungia. Ndeto isusi ya Maverick. Amwea two minutes isi ya kusia fame there up. And he's going to be uh, taking the legal route. And she's about to face it. Na ke Maverick ya amosungia with her audacious way of responding to the issues. Amwea, yeah. Proceed, you know, nito kumwe kumunenga go ahead the green light and uh, nikona evidence ya what I am actually talking about and so you will go no far. Nikuitha ndikukia hizo maujumbe hapa ujisome because uh, some of uh, Maverick's lingo kana language niki odonaste and I will not be reading them. Kuhu, um, nita kwekia hapo pata kujisomea kana wone exchange ilo na inayo na mume wa siombu wa mwele. Na... Um, Weza kwithi ya nengwe guli ya hii. Indi matukwa, where our side pieces get in the confidence to actually come out and say they had affairs with, you know, married men. Where is it coming from? All right? Now, um, think about it. Let's, let, let's roll the clock way back. Mabindani mate na ilandu malo masi ya mesi. Nuweza kwithi ya, the women were very patient. Very patient. Wanawa manamu umu wagu is cheating. Yu ilikuwa siri andoa. Ona wada wena ndoe kumi ndoe dhuki asia. Wea ute siru wa mwethi u ndoe wa mkuli ya kendo. Ok, now I'm not saying that was the way to go. Nundu wa zaagwe ya ibetisi ya tenesia ina uya mwingizi ya kia mwome. Ona mabindamu wa zaagwe ya no mwethi ya no mwethi ya kana bati mbaya nundu it was rare to be found eh. Aume maina atabu. Mawadio jiti. Weza agudhe ya mundu wadhi tumbuktu. Yani na kuna kuku nduwezi munduzu. Onandezi kwa ku. Onandezi kana nutu anete. Mwiga akomana. Ok. Yingi. Kana onedha muka akomana yingi muka akomana yona kutumbuktu. Sienu. Lagini muka wagu. Itha ndaka amana. Kane zoma na akiba hati mbaya. Sana. Kuwa ndu maina ndaya ya mudhe mbozu. Na mua kani weza agudhi ya ni manenga. Maina kikio kingi. Welawe ya mwome moku. Ona maa find out. Kana ona maa rewena ndu mba. Weza agudhi ya esu ni siri ya ndo. Wana wimu ndu kwendo thekewa. Nundu ki ucha ya kitheko kenene kweza kuiwa. Mose wa agu. Ni umali lenza wanyao uo tuwae. So marriage was very respected in that manner. Ki uwa kama duwa. Weza agudhi ya ona diondu. In fact, nye nga gulo na ze kwa marriage certificates ya matuwa ba ilita kuangelua. Ila statement ya, yes, it is true, I will cheat. Will you still cling to me? Will you still stay with me? Yeah, ve ume kwa gula uwe true for better, for worse. Nundu worse, yes, ndi uwetwa. Ndi uwetwa. Pegi ndu, ndi ubreak you are down ugeza kwithi ya niya wetwa ni chao nundu eventually what breaks most marriages usa kwithi ya ni uncontrolled infidelity mtu anachiti ya kwanza ya pili ya nasamewa but then gets to a point where is this too much and either of the partners cannot take it anymore and they decide to call the marriage off na kuhu 
these days things are more crazy and undo we are seeing even the side pieces coming out and speaking about it openly and to make it worse we have social media where when you are nika anyone or you put information there the world is flooded it can go as far as it's shared you know nikyo do no secret with these digital times yeah and uh was a good day kule ile ingine nae na yo ni niki maverick ukumila or you two years later and then it's in 2019 is she jealous of this family or is she telling the truth or really did was she in um conditional relationship with this man ya ila ya either no when andika waneke kana ndika umilie maundu asume kikie while ombika maundu 1 2 3 na you as a good enter baby ka bandu nyao benefits is usia tilika and the woman got bitter and she decided to um hang the dirty linen out there kwende vile kutaenda kana maverick atona the more than bawa miss p no liga no do miss p wo milile asia she was sexually abused she's the one even you look rape yeah ni wili pole but then she comes out later juzi tu asia she wants to apologize kumaanisha hizi vitu zote aliwekelea huyu mwanaume you all remember what happened to his brand yeah um maverick ni mudemba ni mundu wa mudemba wa miss p if kuna na uoni wangu kana uona ni chao um kiende between maverick and the husband to siombo amwele leave your thoughts on the comment section below on what you think about this whole thing yeah and what could be the solution to these issues we are facing today nondo dimu si wa siombo amwele kuisela ke we woka so many families wana wake wengi ambao sikuizi wameshikilia ndoa mwa kumesia kufumilia and praying and hoping that things are going to get better at one point and it's even messier these days because even women also have gotten to the pool of virgins mweme wa dhinza na gundu dhinza na mwigoma ni anomba the families that we are living you know in our societies today twili le mezani and makwa no that is the truth nyenga kulwa how to control such behavior the government needs to enact more laws governing this marriage things kana wili ga mudwa ino geza kwithi ani wizi nye mundu akaka akauma lanza otwa e na nga mwenda kana nga musakwa bado no ndu it looks like it must happen at one point whether you like it or not or whether um I do not want to get into that but yeah um kwithi when laws is you govern this behavior because of whether it's controlled yeah in fact bandu was legal because of whether you can be a woman and then you can give it to you to get it to you to get it to you to get it to you Why can they be taxing this particular individuals don't want to mundu kuma lanza wa musi waga wesa kwithi ya mundu uzwe na kendo hata wanawake pia nundu matukawe na kaingi mnaona mama kwa taguma la nzawa ametoa nayo why can this people be the targets of taxation <laughs> uh, by the government it will control the behavior na ndo mwezi wa kamezini tuone if for the first time mundu akaleo cheat kana nokwa wewe utakufa wewe kala na mzi wangu ukipa uh, familia yako heshima um, marriage is sacred ipo heshima ambayo inaistahili will you die if you do that particular thing as a man and as a woman because today both genders are in it what are your thoughts leave them on the comment section below on what you think can actually control this cheating pattern um, in marriages We nige also bau uh dreadle ku see how this thing is going to be unfolding yeah we are hoping that the family is going to be standing this test of time um well, when things get that messy only prayers really help okay yeah thank you for watching to the very end uh if you enjoy our content always leave a like a positive comment down below Uh, nyengo tunge mwe munene kabisa nondo watch to the very end thank you for always coming back time and time again to watch and rewatch our videos i appreciate you so much make sure that you um are subscribed yani hakikisha eh confirmed you are good tukomane on the next upload nye nitawa gk